Uh, pero sa akin, uh, by the way, Kuya Romy here, uh, sa akin, it's really a bittersweet uh, uh, occasion with Kuya Mon. Peter in a way na hindi na namin siya, hindi na natin siya makakasama sa, sa uh, uh, gathering physically, lalo na sa mga meeting. Uh, but it's, it's a sweet um, occasion knowing that uh, he is now in the comforting hands and safest hands of our faith. Um, a lot of memories na uh, napakasarap na alalahanin with Kuya Mon. Siguro kung, kung bawat isang uh, Junior Eagle member uh, eh, magsasama-sama siguro kulang ang 24 oras, kulang ang isang buwan, kulang ang isang taon para pagtagtig-tagtig yung mga sasayang uh, alam uh, I for one, I'm so proud, uh, even right now, uh, I'm not expecting that I'm part of the Portillas. Uh, pero as I was driving kanina, uh, umuos na yung aking luha uh, kasi malalim pala ako pinagsamaan na yung uh, Being part of the, uh, uh, ano tawag, uh, original members, Charter members ng Albay Junior Eagles Club. Uh, nung una, parang akala ko it's just another organization. Uh, kasi kami yung unang na-invite ni Kuya Mon. Uh, I was then a Tulsay first year student sa class niya. We were like few good men back then. Uh, while yung mga kabataan at our age back then were very busy joining fraternities, and even those days, grabe pa yung tension, away dito, away doon, kukugan uh, dito, kukugan doon. But our group that had been uh, organized and founded by Kuya Mon, we were like few good men in a way na other people na nakakakita sa amin were so amazed and they were so curious and even to the point that they were initiating, asking us, paano kaka-join. And, and back then, we were really like few good men kasi exclusive siya for the boys. Uh, but after a couple of years, finally, may mga very active na, na female students sa BU na nag-initiate. And at the time, uh, talagang we sat down and then uh, we worked out na ma-open to membership even sa, sa females. And uh, Yun. Ang, ang nakakatuwa noon kasi yun nga, we were among the, the, the best, I, I think we were the best at the time, so to speak, uh, na, na US ba uh, university base or college based sport, na kakaiba yung aming mga activities, uh, very academic and, and very uh, healthy uh, youth activities. Uh, and even yung pag-initiate na magkaroon ng uh, inter-schools debate, uh, kami lang yung, ano, yung, yung org na, na uh, pinunda ni Kuya Mon, yung nag-handle naman. Dati, ano lang, high school lang, and, and limited lang. Uh, and then hanggang albay lang. And uh, there was a time, I remember, uh, nag-inter-school, inter-university, and uh, yeah, throughout the um, and uh, ang, ang, ang sayang balikan yung mga ganong uh, alaala. And tama po yung sinabi ni, ni Sir Navarro. Um, si Kuya Mon is not only a, a, a teacher or a professor. After the class and outside the classroom, andun yung ano, respeto namin sa kanya as our professor, pero meron ng kakaibang pakiramdam. Uh, because aside from that, he is somebody else to us. He was really a big brother. And uh, yeah, in introduced niya sa amin, in demonstrated sa amin, uh, yung, yung pagiging kapatid, pagiging kuya. Uh, and at that time, we were not even aware na we were the only Junior Eagle uh, uh, club throughout the country. And uh, nakaka-proud talaga na throughout the Philippines yung yung uh, 
Junior Eagles Club na binuo ni Kuya Mon was the very first to be recognized and be chartered. And sa ngayon nakaka-overwhelm kasi every time merong merong chartering, ang lagi ko siyang naririnig. And, and so truly, Kuya Mon is, is a true legend. Uh, and yun nga, uh, physically, iniiwan nga niya tayo, but uh, uh, we can say na si Kuya Mon, he lived life to the fullest. Maybe we haven't seen him in, in luxurious, you know, outlook. Pero yun ang napaka-unique sa kanya. Because he, he, he showed us, he, he demonstrated to us the simple, and yet the best life. Uh, even itong recently, you know, it took us 32 years para after the, the adject, after the Alpha Junior Eagles Club, uh, naka, nakapasok kami sa, sa senior club. It took us 32 years in the making. After the series of typhoons, and uh, isa ako sa unang pinuntak ni Kuya Mon, sabi niya, it's high time na ma-organize yung mga dating adject. And uh, at the time, I was so busy in Matsas, I want to express how busy I was. Akala ko, sabi ko, graduate na ako sa mga ganong activities and commitment, but never in my in my thought to, to decline the invitation of Kuya Mon. And, and uh, so, yun, nakakatawa kasi because of our reorganization, nakita ko ulit yung mga dating Kuya especially mga kasamahan ko. And, and I was so amazed na ang dami nang lumilipat na ating kasamahan ko. So, si Kuya Mon, he might have clipped his wings, but uh, he will remain flying in the hearts of every one of us. So, patuloy po tayo na ma-motivate and may courage sa mga tinuro at uh, sinayon sa ating ni Kuya Mon. And uh, to the family, Eh, Kuya Mon versus lucky. You know, to, I think you are very lucky having Kuya Mon. Um, and as a family, uh, we, we will try to do our best uh, na maka augment uh, while na si, si Kuya Mon physically is not with us, we will not be with you. But uh, bilang family, bilang magkakapati, we will try to give our best here. Men. Uh, hindi namin, we're afraid we may not be able to compensate uh, yung obligation to Kuya Mon as a father, as the head of the family, but uh, in our own uh, special and little ways, we will try to compensate as, as a Kuya uh, sa, sa family. And, uh, po, there, there's a lot to, to recall, there's a lot to learn, and uh, there's a lot to reminisce with, with Kuya Mon. But anyway, he will be a living legend in our hearts. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank
already gives us the assurance that there is somebody whom we can ensure to lead on because we may not know each other personally, but the very name of being a legal that already connotes that there is somebody who is ready to know. The very essence of service in strong problem. Because no even a legal, somebody will step up. That's something that is very evident to them. And of course, Beyond the egos, I also have to recognize that there are also so many other people that I must have I've touched. There are these students right from the very start of this first year of teaching, these colleagues also. And actually, of course, I'm also very touched that um, his um, batchmates, classmates from high school, uh, elementary to high school to college, and even to postgraduate studies. Almost everybody, and of course, family and friends. The list goes on, and this is very overwhelming for me because everybody is reaching out and trying to make us feel how much it is well loved by so many people. We don't even know them personally, but they all try to contact us, showing how they, how we had touched them in various ways. So this is very overwhelming. So indeed, I may say that we are very proud. I'm sorry. I'm, very, I'm so used to be humble, but this time, uh, humbly proud that I, I am the wife. Okay? And we are the family because he had he is a very good based from what the people have been shown us the past few days. And at the same time, it also gives us the truth is this is giving us a big challenge. How me and our children have to step up and that legacy as to the principles that we had held on throughout the years. It is true, it's so tight In behalf of my family, thank you very much. Just not by us. The angel of death has visited our Sandigan region and clipped the wings of one of our own. A mighty eagle has ceased its flight. May the soul of our Puyamon be safely carried to the afterlife. In all events, the divine providence is up to this ways much higher than our own, but he has given the best they can do. This point of time will be under the same peace to use of the peace 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 of As a symbol of our paternal bond and as a last testimony of our enduring love and respect for you. Mga Kuya and Ate, although we part with our Kuyamon in sorrow, we take comfort and consolation in the, in the belief that in due time we ourselves shall cross a great beyond and join them who has gone before, before us in eternal fellowship. Are you seeing? Please light up your candles. We have to light up candles. We're very proud and privileged that 
na-invite niya ako to start the radial batch of the Alpha Eagle Club. That was circa 1988. We were chartered September 3. We are one of the kind of leaders that creates leaders. It's the kind of man that really touches your heart. Thank you. We have one great leader just like you. I'm also thanking him with my full heart to his guidance and leadership when I was still in my college days. I still remember him. I was under him with the Dodgy and philosophy classes. Thank you, Sad, and by, of course, this is Richard, but we have one will remain in our hearts. Whatever. We love you, we have one. Anyone would like to share? Let me spread across this wondrous land and say, for strength and hope, integrity, let our hearts be proud and free. Take my hand and come with me where eagles fly. Good job. 